And also breaking today at 5, the Big Ten is now pulling the plug on college football this fall, saying it's too much of a health risk. In the last hour, another big conference, the Pac-12, announced it would follow suit, canceling their fall football season. We've got Rich Nye joining us live from Bloomington today. He's got a look at what this big announcement means, not only for football, but all fall sports moving forward. Rich? Yes, yeah, Scott, here in Bloomington, students are moving in for the fall semester. Behind me, you can see the parking lot of Memorial Stadium is serving as a COVID-19 testing site. Well, there will be no football at Memorial Stadium this fall because of COVID-19. Concern over spread of the pandemic led the Big Ten Conference today to postpone the entire fall sports season. And of course, the big sport is football. For each school, an estimated $60 million plus lost with no games on TV, no fans in the stands. Men's and women's soccer, men's and women's cross country, field hockey, and women's volleyball are also postponed. IU Athletic Director Scott Dolson said in a statement that he is heartbroken, adding that as a lifelong Hoosier and IU sports fan, I am disappointed that we won't be able to enjoy seeing our teams compete, but I am most devastated for our students. They invest an enormous amount of time, effort, and energy for the opportunity to represent IU on the field, but as difficult as it is to absorb, I am confident it is the right decision. The Big Ten says that Fall sports might be moved to the spring, but nothing is definitive at this point. Right now, Purdue officials are holding a media teleconference with uh, to talk about this, and we'll hope to hear from reaction from West Lafayette coming up at 6 o'clock. Scott. Yeah, such a disappointing day for so many people. Rich, thanks so much.